We've been following all day a clerk opened fire when a robber tried to hold up a family dollar store. And now that would be robber is dead. All that commotion happened right in front of a teenager. Channel 2's Anusha Rasta is live with more in the Anusha. Did the suspect actually have a gun? Well, Keith, HPD won't say. They tell us that the guy had one hand inside of his jacket pocket as if he was holding a gun. He came in demanding money from the cashier. The cashier fired twice and the suspect ended up dying at the location. A deadly robbery Friday morning at a North Houston family dollar store. Here's video of that scene from Sky 2. Police officers say a man wearing a hoodie and a mask walked into the store full of customers and employees demanding cash. But the store clerk shot him dead at the register. This woman says her daughter was buying school supplies here for a high school project when it happened. She didn't want us to show you her face during the interview. She can't even go in here and shop for something for a school project without being fear of getting shot. Steal a job application. Steal a pen and stop stealing people's stuff. It's still unclear whether or not the man accused of trying to rob this place had a weapon, but people who live in the area say it's a dangerous neighborhood and this isn't the first time anyone's tried to rob these businesses. I don't blame the guy for shooting him and I feel sorry for the family and their loss, but you know, you can't just take people's things like that. Some of the residents want more police officers in the streets here. If residents would like to have some, uh, more police presence, they're, they're more than welcome to contact their local station. The HPD says there were a couple of other robberies in this same area last night, but at this point, they're not sure if they were all related. Reporting live in North Houston, Anusha Rasta, KPRC Channel 2 News. Thank you.